What is up you guys, it is Mr. BMX Riders, and today I just wanted to do a little vlog, and basically, uh, as you can see my bike is all packed up here, and no I'm not selling my bike, <laughs> but basically I'm traveling tomorrow, I'm going to Florida, uh, what part, I'm going to Boca, um, that's where my aunt is, so I'm staying over by my aunt's house, and I decided that for 10 days, what am I going to do there, besides go to the beach and whatnot, but so I decided to take my bike, because you know, or you wanted to try something new, traveling with my bike, maybe that's, I feel like it's kind of cool traveling with your bike, and I always love cruising around new spots, looking for new spots, so I thought, why not take my bike, and basically what I did was, I didn't take it in a bike box, because if you take it in a bike box, it's going to cost like 70, 80 bucks, so uh, this is, this is going to cost me $35, because um, the airline that I'm flying with, you're, you're allowed to uh, take one bag per person, so... I'm traveling with three people, mom, dad, me, and we're taking three luggages. Um, two luggages we're going to share, for all three of us, with our clothing, and I'm t this luggage is going to be for my bike. So basically what I got here is my riding shoes, my beat up bands, put all the tools I need in here. I have a ratchet in here, Allen key, adjustable wrench, uh, another, some other Allen keys. I bought a spare tube. Uh, there's also a bike shop nearby. Also, I deflated the tires a bit because I heard that when you go into up in the five, whatever, 500,000 feet or whatever, how high you go, basically the uh, air pressure expands and it could pop. So I just uh, took a lot of air pressure. I think there's like 50 PSI in there just so I could ride to the bike shop when I get to Florida and pump it up. Also, my chain snap today. Yeah, that sucks. Um, and I didn't have that much money so I had to go with the KMC chain I got a silver one since I got chrome bars forks and stuff silver silver is the next thing that looks close to chrome plus the other colors they had were white I didn't want to get that I also have my gloves in there put my chrome bars in bubble wrap uh, wrapped up the frame real good got the dropouts all taped up um, pedals put it in this it's my stem headset put the wheels there um, I didn't take out the seat. I had to take out my back wheel, front wheel, my pedals, and my fork bars and headset. Because I like traveling with a smaller bag. This is 38 inches long. The width is not even 20 inches, and I still managed to fit my tires in there, and it close, closes perfectly well, as you can see here. And, um, yeah, basically, I'm going to try to get... a. Uh, as you can see, I'm doing this with one hand. It's closing fine. So I'm going to try to get an edit in Florida. And I pro I'm not making any promises that I'm going to do the edit. I'm just saying that I want to because uh, I'm going to have nobody to film me there. Uh, and I don't have a tripod, unfortunately. So I'm going to try to adjust the camera at a ledge or something. And another question that I got, another question that a lot of people ask is, where do you buy bags like this? And, um question to that is go to any hockey bike uh, hockey bike store go to any hockey shop and get a bag like this or this is Wilson this is for like baseball and stuff like that so I went to I suggest going to models or any maybe sports authority maybe anything like that which that deals with sports sporting goods and stuff just get a bag uh, most BMX frames like 20.5 to 21 inches are 35 inches long because I measured it from like the from the top from the headset not the headset the the part where the headset is, I forgot what it's called. The head tube, there we go. The head tube all the way down to the dropout. It's 35 inches long from what I measured. I measured it from a 20.5 frame. Um, not sure about 21 inch. I think it's the same thing. So 35 inches long. So you want a bag that's at least 35 inches so you could take off both wheels and put them in. This bag is 38 inches long and it's $130. I know that's expensive, but the Dance Comp one is 250 the OGO. And with the OGO bag, you don't even have to take out your front wheel. You could keep the back wheel on. I mean, you. I mean, you don't have to take out the back wheel. You could keep that on there because it's. I think it's fifty. Yeah, fifty inches long, so you could fit uh, your wheel in there. Also, another thing that I'm gonna recommend to you got for you guys is buy a bike bag. And if you don't travel a lot like me, like I travel, usually if I go to Florida or something like that, or sometimes I go to Israel. I go maybe once a year, and sometimes I go to cruise ships, and when I go on cruise ships, I don't take my bike because um, there's a lot better entertainment there, so usually I rarely go, and that's why I bought this bike bag, and I'm going to return it as soon as I get back. That's real smart because you, you can save a lot of money, 
Um, just give back the receipt and the tag or whatever. Also, make sure if if, it, um, if it's like if it has wheels on it, make sure you clean the wheels so that when they check it out, it looks new. And yeah, I'm really praying that my bike doesn't get damaged. I wrapped it up with as much bubble wrap as possible. Uh, I, I recommend when you guys um, take your bike, make sure you get everything you need. I got gloves, my shoes, extra tubes, get all the tools you need, don't forget. And um, pack any shirts you need, helmets, knee pads, whatever. Um, also, I, I was really pissed off because I was looking up bike shops near Boca in florida and there was one and it's so stupid like it's a skate park with only skaters allowed and rollerbladers and you need a helmet to enter and i got really pissed off about that but whatever i'm gonna look for street spots to do grinds and uh i'm gonna look for ledges and stuff so this video is getting pretty long i'm gonna end it here if you guys have any questions about flying with a bike or traveling with a bike let me know because there aren't that many um traveling tips <clears throat> with a bike so any questions leave a comment below rest in peace mechanic half track chain and yeah peace